Why choose pedestrian dynamics to model an open air sport event? Pedestrian dynamics features simulation of large crowds up to 100,000 people, capability of large scale infrastructures, integrated 2D and 3D models, microscopic and mesoscopic simulations are possible, integrated output module with automatic report generation. Pedestrian dynamics allows for modeling and visualization of complex infrastructures. Athletes can be incorporated in a model according to real-time schedules and actual routes. Multiple aspects of spectator behavior can also be analyzed. Among others, their interaction with the athletes and their environment. Furthermore, Event staff and resources can be taken into account. And depending on availability, real-time data can be used as a basis for the model. Routing of both athletes and spectators can be modeled. Additionally, the interplay between spectator and athlete routing can be analyzed and optimized. And the capability for large-scale modeling allows for the analysis of complex egress and ingress systems. One can determine whether paid entrance to the event is a viable option. And if so, the optimal capacity for designated view areas can be determined. Moreover, the effect an event has on municipal transport systems can be measured. The consequences of temporary closure of particular terminals on crowd flows can be investigated. as well as the added congestion to terminals that remain in use. Resources for the athletes can also be incorporated into a model, such as security checkpoints and first aid stands. Key performance indicators for these resources can then be derived, for instance, waiting times or occupancies. First responders can be modeled, providing a toolkit for staff planning and positioning. Basic interaction between staff and crowds allow the user to analyze what-if scenarios. Additionally, emergency scenarios and corresponding behavior can be modeled. Spectators and athletes may need to leave the event location due to a safety threat or extreme weather. In this case, the effect of complications like an unavailable exit can be investigated. E-bomb implementation allows for the analysis of the impact of possible bomb threats. Among others, output of a pedestrian dynamics model consists of maps depicting the reach density levels within an infrastructure.
This density is measured in persons per square meter and can also be displayed in graphs over time. Finally, it's possible to obtain information on walking times, for example, in case of an emergency. All in all, Pedestrian Dynamics offers an integrated approach to crowd modeling and is very suitable for open-air sport events.